So I'm recording video. A call comes in. We're on iOS 15, so incoming calls don't take over the screen anymore. Yeah, that's a relief. But if you take that call, it just stops recording. Is this because every app has its own sandbox and only one app can access the microphone at a time? I don't know. <laughs> There's a lot of things I don't know. Let's try the voice app. Same thing. You could see it saved it. Now let's try a third party app, Filmic Pro. It just gives you manual control over the iPhone camera. A big reason for upgrading to a real video camera rather than using an iPhone is convenient full manual control. So what happens when a phone call comes in with Filmic? Oh, <laughs> it just stops recording. How scary. At least it saves the video clip. So I guess third party apps have less privilege than Apple made apps. You know, because the act of just getting a phone call will stop a recording, even though 99% of the time you would consider an active recording to be more important than a phone call. I near exclusively record video on an iPhone XR late 2018. I need an app like Filmic to manually control the camera and lock down what needs to stay fixed for a particular shot. So how could I ever find this workable? Hmm? Well, whenever I have to record anything where I'm gonna be on camera and I can't constantly be checking if I'm still recording, I hit do not disturb, which is now hidden behind focus when you swipe down from the top right, right there on the top, do not disturb forwards all calls to voicemail and limits notifications to those number badges on apps. Now there's also airplane mode that stops wireless communication. It works, but I don't use it because I got the package with Filmic Remote. I think it was $20, so I can use the iPad to control the iPhone or the other way around. And it requires a wireless connection. One last thing. How does Android behave? This is a Samsung Galaxy S10. Recording will be stopped and saved when you answer the call. Well, there you go.